Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Stephanie and I'm so glad you're here today because I'm continuing my postpartum mini series and this video will be all about clothing items. If you're watching this video while pregnant, I do wanna give you such a huge congratulations. You are doing an amazing job. Trust your gut and keep up the amazing work. If you're new to my channel, my name is Stephanie and I make videos all about motherhood. I'm 25 from Michigan and a new mom. I'm currently three months postpartum, so things are pretty still fresh in my head. In today's video, I'll share some clothing items that helped me feel comfortable as well as confident after having my baby. I did have a vaginal delivery, but I just appreciated nothing tight around my belly as well as having access to all of the goods. I'll go ahead and link the products I mentioned in today's video down below or similar as well as other videos in this postpartum mini series. I'd love for you to subscribe to my channel for more motherhood videos and inspiration. Okay, let's get into it. So let's first start with intimates because that is a big part of the recovery process. I mean, a lot is happening down there and then when your milk comes in. So having comfortable underwear as well as bras, super important to feeling comfortable. I really ended up liking these. They're the high-waisted postpartum underwear from Kindred Bravely. They came in a five pack, so it was a good assortment. They, they're high rise, which I really appreciated. And the lace waist is very stretchy and non-restricting. So it was like nice and comfortable around my midsection. Something awesome about this brand too, is that they're actually made for postpartum care. So they have like a little extra space at the bottom. So you're able to fit in like your pads and your ice pack and not have it be like too ill, like not, not have it be too small. So this underwear, I honestly still wear them, but they're a really comfortable option to have after having baby. And for a nursing bra option, well, make sure you don't buy too many um, before you really know what your feeding style is going to be. You know, I plan to breastfeed and I didn't, it just didn't really work out. So I had way too many nursing bras um, from the beginning. So, but what I really did enjoy was the Target's Auden nursing bra. And it's super soft. It has the nursing clip down feature as well. So you're able to access the food. And then something I also really thought was great about this bra was the cups are sewn in. So like after you wash it, you're not like fiddling around with a loose cup and like trying to like stuff it back in and it's all crumpled. Overall, I thought this bra was really great. It's super soft, really comfortable, and um, it's pretty affordable too. So I'd recommend this guy here. Another nice, just stretchy bra to have. I wore this during pregnancy and it's the Simply Worn, this one's like a mouthful. It's the Warner Simply Perfect Underarm Smoothing Wireless Seamless Bra. It's like a mouthful, but so worth it. Um, I love this bra because it just really adjusts to your body as you're growing through pregnancy and then during the postpartum stages as well. So it has adjustable straps. It has an adjustable band in the back as well. Cups are sewn in, it's lightly padded. And something I really like about this bra is it just lays incredibly smooth under clothes. Like you know how sometimes in your bras you'll get like, you can see the cup? This, this one, not one bit. It just lays so flat and so smooth and gives you a nice shape as well. I recommend having at least one nursing tank as well. This one is the Motherhood Maternity Nursing Tank. It has good stretch to it, as well as the nursing clip down feature with the shelf bra. So you're able to access the, you're able to access food when baby needs it. This tank was just comfortable wearing around the house or as loungewear pajamas. Um, so I would recommend having just one simple nursing tank ready to go for you. After bringing baby home, I found out that I really enjoyed going the nightgown route. Again, they are just nice and loose around my midsection. I don't like anything too restricting at all or tight on my belly. And so I really enjoyed wearing my nightgowns. So this first one here is from Motherhood Maternity again. It's a nursing nightgown, so it has your clip down feature and it is light, it's lightly padded and has a shelf bra inside. And it's a really good length. It's not too short and it just hits at an appropriate level. 
and it's also nice and stretchy. So I wore this one even late into pregnancy, so I was able to like accommodate my nice big old baby bump. And then just having it be postpartum, it was easy to access whatever I needed up top, as well as go to the bathroom. That's kind of why I like the nightgowns. They just made it easy for postpartum. It just made it easy for like postpartum bathroom care. So I really like this one and it comes in a cute pattern too. I wear this nightgown a lot as well during pregnancy and even still now. So it's not technically maternity, but it is from Old Navy. It's one of their button down nightgowns. So the cool thing about this is that the buttons are actually functional. So you are able to unbutton it um, as low as you need to have to feed your baby. And then it's also like nice and stretchy too. And it hits at a great length, lightweight, so it's really comfortable for sleeping as well. And then if, if you're going more of like the shirt and short option, because you may wanna run out of the house or you have visitors coming over, or just even to take baby on a walk, wearing more of like a shirt and short felt a little more appropriate for me. So I just still continue to wear my maternity tops for quite a bit. They're just really comfortable. This one's from Motherhood Maternity, one of their V-neck maternity styles. And it has the ruching on the side, so it was able to like nicely accommodate your postpartum belly. And just really soft, just really soft material. So I like that I was able to get use out of this throughout pregnancy, but also postpartum. Another option I wore quite a bit was just like a regular shelf cami bra. Um, God, I think I've had this one since middle school, so that's kind of embarrassing. But this is like the Express Best Love Shelf Cami Bra. And I just like that I was able to stick my nursing pads inside and just wear it with like a cardigan or a zip up hoodie or something. And if I didn't want to wear my maternity bra. So that was another good option to have, and you probably have one in your closet anyways, like I do. <laughs> it was important to have like comfortable shorts for me. I've always preferred more of like that high rise. I just find that it feels better. I feel more comfortable in it, find it's more flattering. So I was trying to find some more higher rise items for postpartum as well. One short that I really like, still wear it now, is the Old Navy Rollover Maternity Short. It's this nice like cotton material, but it has like the roll up band too. So you're able to like pop it over your belly if you're pregnant, but also postpartum, or you could leave it up too, but you're able to roll it down so it hits more of like a mid to low rise underneath your belly, but they're just really comfortable. The band is like non-restricting. Um, there's like a, there's a seam in there, but it's very stretchy. So it, it like adjusts to your body very well. I really like wearing these just around the house or on walks, pajama shorts even. So I would highly recommend checking these out from Old Navy. This Capri here, um, it's from Walmart. It's their Athletic Works brand. And to be honest, it's probably like the least attractive thing you'll ever put on your body, but they are super comfortable. So even though it has like a, a drawstring there, it is super stretchy, doesn't cut into you one bit, and it's just like a nice stretching material all around. Um, so I really just, again, enjoy wearing these like as loungewear around the house. It has pockets too, and they just help keep me cool and comfortable at nighttime. So I found these shorts at H&M. They are a high rise, love my high rise, drawstring sweat short from H&M. And I wear these like mostly out of the house. So these are more my more like styled postpartum short. Uh, they have pockets, which is awesome. I'm big enough to like fit my phone and everything. And these guys, they're just a little more, again, a little more styled, a little more figure flattering. Um, so I enjoy wearing these for like errands or even taking baby on a walk too with some tennis shoes. Thank you so much for watching this video today. I really appreciate it. I hope I gave you some good options for comfortable clothes after having baby. You know, your body changes so much through pregnancy and then the whole postpartum process. So I want, it's, I just want you to be able to feel comfortable and confident in your new mama skin. These items just helps me feel more comfortable and confident in my new skin. And I think you'll really enjoy them too. 
Make sure you give this video a thumbs up today if you enjoyed it. And if you have questions, please leave them down below. I'm three months postpartum, so things are pretty still fresh in my head. So if you have any questions at all about anything postpartum related, I'd love to help answer them for you. There will be more videos coming out in this postpartum mini series. So make sure you stick around, subscribe, and be on the lookout for those other videos. I wish you all a good day and I can't wait to see you next time. Bye!